June Spass Wowers. But let's let everyone on Twitch know. The board is set. The native Fremen dream of creating a green Arrakis. While the Baron Harkonnen wants to paint it red. Smugglers who above all desire profit. And we're titling this. The people on this planet really like their cinnamon. The noble Atreides, bound by the whims of the Emperor, are blinded by their honor. The board is set. Cinnamon. Done. The spice war begins. Again. Man, so... Come on. Don't show your trailer. It's early access. Whatever. Placeholder. It's fine. Never mind. I said I'd reserve judgment. I'm going to reserve judgment. Am I excited about this game? Yes. Am I excited about it not being an old-style RTS like the classic Dunes we've all come to know and love? No. Oh. I was supposed to resume. Eh, I didn't. I didn't really even start the game last time. So, as we, let's give another... Let's give another quick look. I'm gonna be Atreides. I'm, I'm gonna be Atreides. As as we found out last time, we have House Atreides, House Harkonnen, the Smugglers, and the Fremen. Even though the Fremen are supposed to be aides to House Atreides, so this whole thing's weird. But let's do it. And last time, right when we started, we had the counselors that we picked as. Lady Jessica and Gurney. That's fine. Let's give a brief synopsis again of House Atreides. The stellar reputation of House Atreides owes a lot to its leader commanding leader's commanding style. Firm, yet honorable and fair. By Imperial decree, the Atreides just inherited the stewardship of Arrakis and have a lot of work to do to take over from the Harkonnens. Star game. Yeah, I I literally turned this on last time. I don't know. I said it like turned it on last time. Uh, turned it on and then my son woke up, so I had to stop before I was able to do really anything whatsoever. In uh, once once it came up, Arakin. All right. So for those that don't know. This is like my first 4x strategy game, really. So, there might be some, might be a bit of a learning curve. Zoom out, zoom in. What's this? Spice field. Okay. I see. I see. I like that perspective. Nice. Ornithopter. Exploring Arrakis is vital to find the precious spice, as well as other resources. Each region contains points of interest that your ornithopter can wreak on. Ready. Okay. I heard that ornithopters have a automatic setting. Is that in... Is that like something in the gameplay? General graphics. It's probably a graphic option, right? Controls. Hmm. Nope. Currently inactive. Developments. Oh. And uh, one of my viewers told me the pause button is good while I'm learning all this stuff. Yeah, definitely want to do that because I'm just... Oh, auto recon. Here we go. Auto recon on. Detects stealth units and sandworms from further away. This unit cannot be targeted by an attack. Ornithopters can't be attacked. 
Huh. Yeah, they weren't... I don't know about Emperor. I don't have experience with Emperor, but in Dune... Uh, Dune 2000... Well, and Dune, too. Um, you, your missile turrets could take out Ornithopters before they were able to cause any damage, but... Huh. Hmm. 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 Let's see. All right. Getting started. Our priority is to set up our spice harvesting operations. We must find a village in a region with a spice field. We must find a village in a region with a spice field. Search for spice. Okay. Okay, so he's on auto. If he wasn't, would I just be able to point and click and command? How, do, how does movement work in these 4X games? I don't know. Imperial tax, 80 spice tax. I have no spice and I need 80. Yeah, that's one thing I hope is not true. I heard that spice, the only thing it's really used for is to pay off the the um, the guild. Bribe the guild. That's like that's the reason you're on this planet. I would assume it's going to be more more valuable than that, but Read every page before dismissing. Yep. Then you'll need to build a refinery and deploy its harvester to start harvesting. Okay, so you have to move from region to region. And am I automatically capturing this now? There's a spice field. What is this? Okay, this is a harvester wreck. Oh, so there's just stuff I'm finding right now. Harvester wreck. User wreck is infiltration. Agents. Duration, eight days. How fast is time moving? Grab leftover spice. currency it's asking for is an agent. Completion speed progress depends on how many agents are assigned on Arrakis infiltration. Yeah, how many do I have? How many do I have? Villages are defended by militias. If you defeat them, your units will occupy the village, unlocking the possibility of taking control using authority or pillaging for resources. Huh. Okay, so I have to attack this village. Let's let's go ahead and get the spice reward for this. Oh no, Ornithopter, where are you? Let's let's go ahead and turn off your. Auto. On vector. Go over there. Am I doing everything right here? Four hundred for another ornithopter. Let's hear recruit units. Each military unit has a training and an upkeep cost. Oh, no. No. Doy. Trooper Ranger. Let's see. Troopers are fierce melee fighters. They become stronger when supported by specialized units. Yep. Or with medium range projectile weapons, Rangers are best used alongside defensive units that can protect them. Okay, what do I got here? Where are these resources. Ugh, already having a resource overload. My god. 
3 out of 18. Wait, what is being used here? Oh, uh, wait. 220. 3. 3. And then this is their attack and defense. Okay. Cost, attack, defense. I'm, I'm a silly guy. And then the 18. Command points. Yeah. Okay. 200 upkeep. Yeah, there's an upkeep cost. There's an upkeep cost. I gotta worry about feeding and sheltering my army. Each military unit has a training and upkeep cost. They also cost a certain amount of command points, which limits the size of your army. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Give me the one soldier. I guess I'll have to... Uh, I don't know how I'm supposed to harvest spice if... Resolve. 57 spice, okay. Okay. A unit with units whose supply as they move outside of your territory, a unit with no supply will die from exposure. Is this my supply? Yes. Deducted from income damage. Hmm. Supplies refined is refilled while staying close to a controlled village or base. Deep deserts are especially damaging for the supply. Okay. On duty. I still have two hundred though. Like, why does it say there's a cost? Is it just as long as you have those things? That's what you need to... Because it didn't take any of this. What is this? Oh, hedge money. I thought that was gold. This. Salari. That's what I, I see. Awaiting orders. Yes, sir. Okay. Auto recon. Let's turn that back on. Okay, oh, so it was a whole platoon, not just a single soldier. We are ready. One. And. Okay. And what's this? Minerals. Awaiting command. Waiting for your order. Do you, do you pick that up? How do I get that? And where's my rangers? Okay. Yes. Yes. Awaiting command. Yes, sir. At your service, sir. Oh, well. Attack! Let's attack these sand people. Is that a racist comment? Star Wars is racist. Let me see. Just kidding. Hey, pop stars. This game is cool. I mean, maybe. I've only played from that so far. So these are the Fremen that we're taking out. Okay. 
All right, so occupied. Okay, let's pause it again. Okay, so now I need to village just space. Okay. Okay, so I got a village. Now I need to get a spice refinery or harvester. Right? Take control. Sure. Go ahead and just take the control. Okay, and yeah, what should I be? Okay. Okay, so there's more Solari with that. Another village. Yes. Okay, let's go ahead and boost up. Let's, let's get a ranged ranger. Ready. On the move. Should I like? Do I need to stop my ornithopter and just investigate everything that he comes across? I thought. He's just exploring the ground, I guess, and show me what I might be able to get. What's this? Development research. Oh. Skill and tech trees. Okay. Oh, pause. Jeez. I keep forgetting that. That's that's one of the big things. This almost seems like a turn based game, yet it's Actively running. Um, so, agents signed on comb infiltration produce 100 more solari. Comb. Comb infiltration. Negative 15 authority cost to an ex village. Local dialect studies. Unlocks the military base building, increases army's max supply 50%. Hmm. Hmm. So it's basically. Basically, politics. War. Excuse me. Jeez. Politics, war. I might go with the local dialect studies. Negative 15% authority cost to an exa village. Unlocks a craft workshop. Crafts workshop. Okay. And let's go. Go. There's another village. Hmm. It's gonna take a while to get used to this game, I think. This is throwing me off. I'm, I'm just expecting to be able to craft units constantly and just play like old style RTS. Okay, I guess. Ooh, wait, what? Yes. What is that? Whatever that is, it is helping to. I guess everyone's fine.
Okay. I need more water. Okay, so how many days left do I have until the spice guild? Seven days. Okay. All clear. This on this. Can, can I like pick? Yes, sir. Sir. Okay. Let's go. Just investigate that man. Jeez. Raid detected. Raiding party has been seen close to your territory. Your villages and harvesters could be their targets. Oh, yeah? What is that? Listening. We'll take them out. Taking position. For the Duke! Raiders can come out of hidden sieges to free villages from your control. Each raid suffered gives a chance to reveal the hidden siege it came from. Each raid suffered. Hmm. Every 25 days you'll have to pay the imperial tax. Failing to do so will cause various penalties. Collected spice can be stockpiled to pay taxes or sold to the comb for Solari. You can change the amount of spice you sell in favor of stocks. Stocks? Stocks? You can change the amount of spice you sell in favor of stocks. Oh my god. The spice to Solari, to Solaris range, exchange rate changes frequently. Think to check it. Gonna reserve judgment. Gonna reserve judgment. At your service, sir. But I will say, the things presented to me in this game, some of them have not been my my personal cup of tea. Take that as you will. Of course, that isn't a review for this game, but will a review be on coming? And how soon will it come? Defender. Thank you. What is Sandworm nearby? Ready. Yes, sir. Hmm. Sandworm detected. Wait a minute. Okay, Sandworm's gone, I believe. Trade request. You received a How trade. Ah, uh, not so great. Plasticrete influence for Solari, Intel, and Spice. Time's almost up for the spice. Um, decline. Sorry. Resolve. Okay. Now I got enough spice. Where's my ornithopter? Where is my ornithopter? Okay. Uh... Again. Let's... Build... A 
Oh. Okay. So... Okay, so let's let's build one. Build a refinery. How do I build a refinery? I'm not ready to spend that. How do I build a refinery? Pause this thing. Did I say pause? Yeah, the most, the most, like, off, uh, the most out-of-the-norm RTS that I have fallen in love with is Battle for Middle-Earth. Um, like, the, you would have those plots. It was actually kind of a simplified RTS, in a way. You would have those plots where you could build specific things. Um, and you would, if you build a base, you would have, like, eight plots around it where you could, where you could choose um, from a selection of, like, three, four, sometimes five different things or more. But you could only build certain things on certain spots, and it was much more, I don't know, much more organized. You didn't have uh, personal personal freedom in, in where you could build stuff. And of course, in Battle for Middle Earth 2, they allowed you to go ahead and like, pretty much like place your walls and everything anywhere you wanted to build your base, the outer walls of it. Um, but yeah, definitely going to be playing that game on stream sometime. But for now, I just learned how to build a refinery. So, 500 plastine. Let's see, let's take a quick look. Refinery, we all know what that does. Maintenance center, negative 30 buildings, Solari upkeep, and plastic upkeep. So basically just an upgrade for your, your uh, consumption of resources. Plus three water for each level of wind in the region. Wind trap, okay. Fuel cell factory, plus six fuel cell. Military and state. Does that say statecraft? I mean, I need my glasses. Listening post plus two influence production plus one knowledge and plus two hegemony. And they all keep gold to keep going. They all cost gold. Ah. Oh, ah. Okay, I see. I see. Well, let's build it on the edge. Okay, add building slots. Add a building slot to the village for 100 plastine. Let's do it. Hmm. Militia. Ranged militia. Veteran militia. Okay. Let me let me go over this stuff up here again. And I think I'm I'm like not micromanaging enough. I should be should be look so, so I guess you want to just keep exploring as much as possible, and you can 
just expand your base as you go on. It's all done by region. I'm slowly wrapping my brain around the quadrant aspect of this gameplay. For anyone that loves this game but yet doesn't know of the masterpiece of like Dune 2000, oh, we're gonna find out. We're gonna find out what kind of masterpiece it is. It's great. I played Dune 2 recently in, in the browser and that was... That's an experience. You can you have to select each individual unit at a time. You can't multi-select or anything. You can't drag and drop anything like that. And you just have to click, attack, click, attack, click, attack. It's great. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and take my my army of colonists and just keep going around and round. Let me see, what is this? You need to assign agents to Arrakis Infiltration. So... Let's see, unlocked at 2,000 uh, 2, Hedgemony. Like, what is unlocked? What is What am I getting over here? Let's go ahead and take that. Um, where's my ornithopter? Yeah, I do want two ornithopters now. And I guess that's it. We can speed up or slow down. Okay. Where are my ornithopters? There's one. Ready. Combat ongoing? Okay. Yes. Listening. Take them out, boys. And girls. Because I have a... I have a unisex army. We're about gender equality here in the sandy sand future. Okay, we're... Sandworm detected. Oh no. Okay. Is it good now? Sandworm. Don't want... None of those sandworms. I can't... T okay. So, I guess I don't have to expand anymore because... Or, I don't need to worry about it at the moment because I have no resources to do so. I need to get... Like, where are you at, man? Where are you at? Let me see. Can I... Can I put you as... One... Or let... Let me see. I'm going to keep you as Ornithopter 4. And I'll have the other one. Let's see. What do you want? Ooh. The Harkonnen. Force Treaty. doesn't seem happy. Okay. New spice tax has been established on the following period. Mean time 24 days. Pearl tax man 92. It's just only keep getting higher and higher. Sweet. 1 to 1.6 of slow. Okay. Previous rate 1 to 2. Currently expected stocks for next tax. Ugh. Spice stock. Get the hell out of here. Okay. 
I'm gonna go ahead and get these um, these crash shuttles and harvesters and stuff. Might as well, I'm just leaving money on the floor, right? Money. Development research. I should. I should deal with this. Composite materials, negative fifteen percent village construction costs. Diplomatic maneuvers. Hmm. Resource production villages with exactly one building plus twenty percent. Plus 0 0.02 knowledge per controlled village. Native water upkeep for the. Hmm. This is all good stuff. Plus 30 recon spend of points and interest. Mil military units have negative 30% daily supply drain. Ornithopter 30% speed. This is all good. All good. Harvesters will attract sandworms. At the first worm sign, you have to recall your harvester if you don't want it to be destroyed along with its crew. You increase spice production by adding more crew to your harvesters. Oh yeah. So... Okay. okay. Deploy, enable auto recall. Yeah, auto recall first sandworm, but um, I've heard that you have to put them back out, going out. automatically. Is it going out when? Yes, please do. We're going out. Deploy. Don't they move on their own? An ornithopter always, or a carryall always has to take them? Are you kidding me? So, let's, I guess, take Attack. out some of these villages, or at least, you know, colonize them, <laughs> just so they can be ready when we do have the resources we need. I guess I need to build, I need to build, uh, wind traps, I need to build a wind trap. I need to build a wind trap. Plasteel. Let's build a plasteel factory. Okay. I'm getting spice, which. Oh. Wait, didn't I already? Didn't I already take... Didn't I already do this, guys? Isn't this village already mine? Missing resources. Lands Red Council vote. Three resolutions are put up to vote at every council. Each faction can use votes or influence to pass or counter resolutions. Some special re resolutions, called charters, may be unlocked during the game. Each charter has its own unlock conditions and also eligibility conditions that you'll have to fulfill if you want to get elected for one of them. Now I'm running for office in this game.
water regulation plus 30 percent water upkeep plus 100 percent unit recruitment cost plus 30 percent influence production or negative 30 percent and what's this what is this What is that? I have 100. Along with the influence, votes represent your political might. They can be allocated to vote on the Landsrad resolutions. Influence, unlike votes, is lost when used. I see. I see. Plus 30% water upkeep. Why would I vote for any of this? Am I missing something? These all suck. And I get them back. I get them back when... Whenever. The next lands round. It says, influence, unlike votes, is lost when used. Okay, so I don't lose them. Kind of confused. We'll see. We'll see how this goes. Working on the wind traps. Where are my ornithopters? Oh my gosh, it's still building. Investigated. Let's get over here. We're going out. Okay. Do I have to recall you automatically? How full... How full are you? Crew is hired by spending manpower. Do I not have... Do I not have any... Spice in this? Missing resources. God. Did I do something wrong? I need to I need to get more manpower now. We're going out. Because I don't think my harvester is actually collecting any spice. How do I get this manpower? Manpower. I need manpower. Plus four manpower production. Okay. Now I just... Okay. So eventually... Bila Kaifa. What had to be said has been said. The resolution is right. 
Let us hope for the best. What is that about? How is Arrakis treating you? You have no Solari left. Jesus. Increase your share of Solari sold to Comb, or trade with other factions to get more Solari. Destroy expensive units or buildings. Increase your share of Solari. Oh, because these have upkeep, of course. Hmm. Okay. Well, this is bad. I need to sell hmm I, yeah can I can I trade empower deficit yeah one oh health regeneration is down spice production promising politician okay oh pause let's pause a bright politician has come to your attention maybe there's a mutual gain somewhere Pick his brain, prerequisites, get elected to positive resolution, can't do that, and can't do that. Twelve days. Mm, I'm a bad Arakeen governor. We are making progress. The last thing we need to do is start producing spice by constructing the last... Thing. Oh, the last thing we need to do is start producing spice by constructing a refinery in the village near the spice field. Um. Oh, yeah. And I don't have a man. I have no manpower. Jesus. And I assume that's why it wasn't harvesting spice. Because there's no manpower whatsoever. Construction complete. Subach Un Kuha. Where's where's that where's that resource at? I don't want spice. Raid detected. Ready. As you command. Yeah, I should probably leave a few units there. That'd be wise. On duty. Take him out. How do I? I need 50 manpower. Like, I have to be doing something wrong, right? We are ready. I need to put someone in the harvester, yeah, I need... Span unit. Kind of need to, don't I? Yes. So my army isn't as big. We're focused. 
to learn a thing or two about army size and upkeep. Ornithopter is currently inactive. Sir? Oh, okay. Yeah, sorry, dude. Auto recon on. Where's my other one? Waiting for your order. Ready. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm doing something wrong. What would that be? When would that be learned? I... How do I sign agents to Arrakis Infiltration? Do I just like wait until I have 2,000 hedge money and then? How can I help? I know you got him. Huh. Isn't it fun when I have to learn a, a game entirely on stream? I'm so chatty and talkative. Negative 50% units recruitment cost. Say what? Can I vote on this stuff? Not yet. Hmm. Ah, I can check them before the voting starts. Got it. that vote. Okay, okay, so I have enough manpower now. We're going out. Okay. Okay. So, let's deploy. Got it. Imperial tax. Sandstorm detected. Ok, 
Okay, how do I... Oh, can I really not, like, turn? How do I, uh... Come on, guys. Can I really not turn? Turn the map? What am I doing? I'm gonna turn the map. Okay. Spice production. Confirm. It's, that's done. That uh, task I got three hours ago is now done. That's gonna get some sand in your pants. We're going out. All right. That's all. Twenty-four spice is what I have in there. Okay. Almost there as far as the Yes. Understood. All right. And no no enemies have really attacked me besides just Fremen in the desert. What's up with that? What's up with that? Yes, sir. Fremen in the desert attacking me. What's up with that? I feel like I could have beat the entire Atreides campaign of Dune 2000 by now. Maybe I should make that into separate streams. Beat each of those campaigns separately. Atreides, Ordos, Harkonnen. And then I'll just quit every game of Harkonnen because I never liked them. The evil. Traveling on what? What is this? They're smugglers ornithopters. What are you guys doing? You better quit. You better get out. I was just about to say, I'm surprised I haven't been attacked or anything yet. Let's get to business. Business. We're going out. Okay. Oh, and who are you? Fremen. Raider. Okay. I was just talking about how uh, it's like, I don't know, nothing's coming to attack me or anything. It was cool. Yeah, I need, uh, need some more guys now. Ooh, I'm lacking the resources. Oh, this is... This isn't going to go that well, I don't think. This is 
this is over. They're already taking my stuff. They're already taking my stuff. I'm losing my... I'm, if they take this village, do I automatically lose my spice? And, One hundred. I am negative. Solari. Village under siege. Resource deficit. Okay, I need to trade. We're going out. We're going out. This, this is not working. Hmm. This, this is not working. I don't know what I'm doing either. I don't think... Oh, God. Espionage, spectral imaging. Oh. Zandri. I see. I see. Okay. I see. Intel production. Harkin infiltration production. I see. Manpower production. Okay. I was missing this the entire time. You can assign agents to various postings to get different bonuses. Each agent has a special trait. Under siege, resource deficit, new lands red council, and inactive harvester. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna save this game. Okay. I'm going to save this game. I'm going to, for now, end the stream. I will come back to this specific game, but I feel like there's so many aspects of this game. Once again, it's my first 4X. I need to, I need to take it in. And I hate to say it, I'm not being entertaining right now, because I'm just like... So, I will return soon with more Dune Spice Wars. In the meantime, I'm probably going to take a break, and maybe I'll be back later tonight with a new game, but check out the games list. Uh, you'll have a good idea of what I'm going to be playing in the future on, this, on these streams. And if you're watching on YouTube, subscribe to Twitch. Or not, don't subscribe. I mean, I, I'm not an affiliate or a partner yet, but follow on Twitch. Check out that Discord. Join the Discord. Keep up with it. This is going to be big. going to be big, folks. Big. Keep coming back. Thank you for watching.
Goodbye.